Maybe. But hey, so I'm here at the uh, the family pizzeria here. Uh, we're at Hog River Brewing, and this this pizza behind me is really the key to the event. And uh, hopefully, I don't uh, mess around with the video anymore. We've talked a lot about uh, Neapolitan style pizza right, that yeah. uh, it's using fresh ingredients. Yep. You're not looking at so much cured meats, the pepperoni, the prosciutto. Yeah. The, um, you're using, uh, in, in, you said in Sicily, which is really where your uh, pizza is from. You use like fresh egg and seafood? So so over in Sicily it's whatever you can find local and whatever you can find fresh. They have, uh, they're gonna get, yes, the cured meats, but it's fresh catch of the day. You'll find a lot of seafood on the pizza. You'll find a lot of uh, hard boiled egg uh, on pizza. Um, just something that you, they can get their hands on and that, that it's plentiful. So, so you said hard boiled egg. Yeah. Now, I, I find that a soft boiled egg or just like that yolk is the most decadent thing you can put. Do you get they, that kind they of flavor? Do, they, you do get that and they do that as well. Um, Typically working in the ovens that we work in, we imported the oven from Italy and the oven's cooking at about 650 degrees. So to kind of keep that soft texture to an egg is a little bit difficult. And you really got to uh, keep an eye on what you're doing as far as your heat counts. Now when you're talking 650, your regular like home oven usually goes up to about 450 and on broil, maybe it can get to 500. Maybe 500 beyond that, you'll probably 500. blow up your oven and exactly. run so into a little bit of a problem. Exactly, what do you use um, here? It's all wood fired, so we get a wood lot of fire. wood uh, BTUs out of the hardwood. We don't yep. use any kinds, any softwoods or things of that nature. And it's just a very, very efficient oven with a, a, a good convection to it. Uh, it's dome style with a flat top and it's all brick oven. Um, we get the oven hot, it takes about two hours to get it up to temperature. Uh, from a cold standpoint, and then we just move everything over onto the side as far as our coals go and cook on the opposite side for the pizzas. There you go. So uh, your foodie pizza that you brought here, you said was the... Uh, it's the Dolce. So that dolce. one's a white pizza. It's bacon and honey. We start with an olive oil base. We put a little bit of mozzarella cheese on it and bacon. And then yep. um, when it comes out of the oven, we add the honey to it uh, once it's nice and hot. We don't want to put the honey on it before because the honey has a tendency to burn. Well, I would imagine 650 degrees with honey. It doesn't matter clover, hardwood, right. doesn't matter what you're you're gonna get burned. You're gonna get burned. Yep. Anything sure that you're working with. Absolutely. Um, it's gonna take a quick look in here. All right, this is the dolce that he's been talking about. Um, you can see the the nice char on the outside, which you really only get with something that's uh, you know 650. Um, but the bacon is nice and crispy. I've had a slice of this before. This is really tasty stuff. Yeah, we do that one. We also kind of stick to the roots a little bit. We play around in the oven, do a little bit of test oven. We don't have it at this event, but to stick with the uh, Sicilian theme, we do a nice uh, shrimp scampi pizza. Shrimp scampi um, pizza. Yeah, we, uh, and in the New Haven region, we ob obviously have to do a clam pizza. Of course, because um, it's New area. Haven, and well, right. New Haven has got their own little pizza style, and sure. we're not gonna go into that right now. <laughs> Um, but we, what we do, uh, variation off of that, I call it the angry clam. The angry um, clam, what's yep, on that? It's a clam pizza with a little bit of bacon, so it's a clams casino style, but we add a little bit of jalapeno to it as well. Clams, just to give it bacon, a bit of a kick. jalapeno. Now is it like pickled or fresh? Uh, we do pickled jalapeno. All right, um, so you get a little bit of that vinegar taste to it too that also milds yeah, out the, yeah. uh, the heat. You want to mild out the heat because you don't want to ruin anybody's taste buds. You want them to be there able to enjoy go. the ingredients that they're tasting on the pizza. Absolutely. Well, hey, it's been an absolute pleasure. Now, where can online. I find your pizza? Uh, well, you can find us uh, online at the Family Brick Oven Pizza Truck dot com. It's, yep. it's under Family Pizza Truck dot com. If you want the truck, it's here. But if I'm if I'm looking, to actually, go to where you're at. If you're if you want to go to where I am, I'm at. Look, at, uh, excuse me. Like us on Facebook. It'll give an announcement as to where we're going to be. We yep. only operate out of the truck. This is only our out of the truck. Absolutely. So there's no there's no actual like brick and mortar store. Only out of the truck. Like them on Facebook. Figure out where they are and uh, eat some really good pizza. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Take care. You too.